Hi, my name is Dennis Narada, and uh, I'm an IT professional. And uh, I just went through four months of absolutely insanity, absolute insanity in getting recruiters to talk to hiring managers, to recruiters to talk to applicants like myself. So I've decided to put a skit together and kind of get a, an understanding of what it is that I was dealing with. So for example, hiring manager sitting at his desk. Well, it's about time for me to get someone in here to look at these computers. I've had them for nine years. All we've been doing is playing solitaire. Ah, uh, let me call Diane up at the front. Hey, Diane. Uh, it's the hiring manager. Um, you know, I'm going to need for you to take a, a, a ad in the paper for our local newspaper here um, for a computer dude. He's got to do something with these computers. I mean, I bought them 10 years ago, and all we've been doing is playing solitaire. Yeah. What do you mean? You're going to put it, you're going to call a recruiter. Recruiter? What do they do? Oh, oh, they get like the job description and everything like that from me. All right, can't we just put that in the newspaper? Oh, no one reads that anymore. All right, well, call, call a recruiter and let me know. All right, thanks. Bye. Hello. Oh, hey, Diane. Oh, you got the recruiter on the other line? All right. You think he's a recruiter? You don't understand him? All right. Is he asking for, uh, is they asking for me, a hiring manager? Okay. All right. Yeah. Go ahead and put him through. Maybe, maybe he's calling me for this position that I'm going to put in the newspaper or wherever he's going to put it on the internet. Yeah, that's right. All right. Put him through. Hi, this is the hiring manager. Whoa, 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 whoa. So slow down, slow down, slow, slow down, slow down. All right. First, let me get your name. What? Oh, Muhammad. Okay, Muhammad. All right. Last name. Singh. Okay. So Muhammad Singh. So now, now I understand. Um, okay. And what company are you from? A bot, a bot. Okay. Are you guys in the United States? There's a weird number that you're calling from. Okay. You are in the United States. All right. Okay. Well, I'm looking to get uh, someone to come over here and take a look at my computers. I've uh, been using them just for for games lately, I need, I need to get someone to come in and and uh, get some work done on these computers. Yeah. Uh, are, you, are you in the United States? You are? Okay. All right, so uh, how do we get this started? Okay, so you want a job description. All right, well, the description of the position is probably going to be computer guy. Yeah. Yeah, computer guy. Now you need more descriptive. Uh, good computer guy. How about that? Now a little bit more. Software, hardware. All right, how about software, good computer guy? There's someone who has been in or been around for a little while, but not too long. We don't want anybody over 50 years old. I don't need anybody like that. No. No, we're going to keep it at a, a minimum. So just put, put, put that in. And uh, it's going to be on site. Yeah, it's going to be on site for sure. Okay, bye. Yeah, Mohammed. Yeah, I lost you there. Um, it looks like we have a very detailed job description uh, and it's going to have to be on site. Yeah. Well, you could just put it put in Chicago 
I was put in Chicago. But uh, I'm actually in Evanston, so yeah, eh, I, I see it as part of Chicago. Yeah, so when they call, I'll just tell them I'm in Chicago, and you know, they'll, they'll just come, and I'll tell them, yeah, come to Chicago, but they're going to have to come up to Evanston. It's going to kind of be a surprise when they talk to me about where I'm located, and I'm going to need them here every single day. I'm not sure about this whole remote thing anyway. Remote people typically don't do much work anyway, what I found out. All right, well, where, where do we go on next? All right, well, some of the requirements, the uh, technical skills. All right, um, well, I'm going to have to have them do a little bit of, I heard their SQL, SQL. Uh, you're going to have to spell it just like that, S, capital S, capital Q, capital L. Yeah. No, no, you don't want to do S-E-Q-U-E-L. No, it, I believe my uh, my wife's sister's neighbor brother installed something called SQL, and they call it SQL, but you don't want to spell it out. It's just called, it's just SQL. So I have something like that installed. He installed it a couple of years ago, and I think that'll help out. Um, doing something, getting things arranged. But um, uh, apparently there's a, a big computer that's involved, so I'm going to need a, a very extensive uh, um, ex extensive SQL person. So a, a computer guy that knows SQL, I think that that'll be just perfect for the, uh, for the, for the technical skills anyway. Yeah, and then uh, that, that should be about it. Um, you know, I got Windows on here, so they got to know Windows. Um, I think that should be about it. Just SQL, you know, SQL, SQL, SQL. Everybody knows SQL, um, from my understanding. I think the, the guy at the grocery store even understood what I was talking about when I said SQL. But, um, yeah, so just put that on there as the job description or this, the technical skills. And then the job description is going to be a... Uh, a very experienced um, computer guy that knows SQL. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's going to be it. Yeah, and then the location is going to be Evanston, but don't put Evanston, put Chicago, because no one's going to come drive into Evanston, so we're going to have to put Chicago. That way, if they think they could take a train, they're going to have to take a, a taxi up north, and it's part of Chicago anyway, if you ask anybody. Um, so that'll work. Uh, soft skills. Oh, soft skills. Okay. Um, oh, communication skills. Yeah. Well, yeah, they're going to have to speak English. Um, they're going to have to tell me when they want time off and when they're sick over the phone. Oh, you mean communicate among their peers? Yeah. Yeah. They can go ahead and do that. I believe, you know, they can talk to other people if they know English. English is going to be very important in this position. Because no one in this uh, in this uh, company understands anything but English, so English will be great. So put that down. English is a must. And um, and then the other soft skill. Oh, be able to. Uh, okay, to be able to talk all to different departments. Oh, well, I'm not sure the warehouse guys are kind of tough. <laughs> I'm not sure if this guy's going to be able to talk to the warehouse people, but they do have some computers back there. Um, so that, that's called what cross-functional. Yeah. Uh, I'll talk to the warehouse guy and see if they're, they can, they can speak to, uh, this, this candidate if, uh, if he comes out, but, uh, yeah, the soft skills and then make sure that, uh, you know, we have him in, in, uh, Evanston. All right. So, uh, get that, uh, website. I don't have a website. Um, I, I don't really need it. Um, I'm first in the phone book um, under computers or under uh, tools, uh, AAA uh, tool company. So I think uh, people can find me, you know, basically in that uh, in that book if they need to find me. Or I guess you can give them my number. They can call me, set up an appointment. All right. So we have that. And uh, go ahead and set that up and um, let me know. Okay. Thanks. Well, we got that going. I think uh, I think we should be able to get somebody in, in a reasonable amount of time. I mean, everybody knows SQL, and you know the job description looks pretty simple. And coming to Chicago is easy. 
even though I'm in Evanston. But, uh, oh, there's Muhammad again. Hey, Muhammad. Oh, you, you got it up there. Okay. It's on, it's on a thing called LinkedIn. Okay. All right. Um, all right. Sounds good. All right. I'll uh, wait for someone to call me. I put my phone number on there. Thanks. Well, that's good. Well, we got it on LinkedIn now. And, uh, oh, wait a minute. Let me call Muhammad real fast. Oh, hey, Muhammad. Listen, why don't you throw C sharp in there too? Yeah. Yeah, C sharp. Yeah, C and then that, 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 uh, the thing above three. Uh, yeah, that's the, that's C sharp. Yeah. I, I don't know why I'm putting it out there, but typically I'm, I, I've, I've heard, uh, like I said, my wife's sister's, uh, neighbor's son. Uh, he said that uh, everyone knows C sharp, so I guess this guy coming in should pretty much know C sharp. All right, uh, yeah, C sharp, and and uh, I think that'll do it. If you can still fit it in there, is that that'll be enough for the person to know? Okay. All right, so SQL and C sharp. All right, talk to you later. Bye. Oh, it's Muhammad again. Hey, Muhammad calling kind of at a strange time, but uh, well, what's up? Oh, LinkedIn won't won't let you put my phone number up there? Only your information? Okay, so if they apply on LinkedIn, it's going to go to your phone number or email? Okay, so they can't call me directly. They have to call you. Okay, so all right. Well, then I'll have to go with that. Um and then, yeah, and then uh, I guess I'll wait for you to call and, uh, you know, get me some applicants and uh, fill in this position. So, um, all right, well, uh, keep me posted and uh, let me know. Thanks. No. So now I'm the applicant and uh, I went ahead and I got an email from a person by the name of Muhammad. Um, from I have no idea what company that is, but um, I don't know. I'm excited. I just got this email. They're looking for a computer guy. It's right up my alley. I know computers. Um, it says SQL. Uh, I mean, everybody knows SQL. I could just pretty much get a book on that. Um, C sharp. I'll ask them if they want it. I I don't know what that even is. But uh, hey, honey, I'm excited. Um, I'm gonna get this job. Should should I should I uh, apply for it? Oh, she needs me out of the house. Okay. All right. Well, I'll go ahead and send uh, my uh, brand new resume that I just paid $200 for to get it uh, uh, specifically for robots. Apparently, robots take the uh, resume before it gets to the uh, the recruiter or the hiring manager. Um, for some reason, they don't have the hiring manager's phone number. Um, I know it's triple eight tool is the name of the company but they don't have a website um i i don't know how to, how to look for these people but uh uh what i'll do is uh i'll send an email back to muhammad and uh and uh see what uh, he has to say my resume is nice and prepped i got a nice cover letter and um yeah hopefully we'll uh we'll get in uh in the triple a um hardware all right i'll send it off Hey, Mohammed. Hi, this is uh, De Dennis, the applicant again for the uh, the computer guy with SQL and, and C Sharp. It's been about a week since uh, I sent off this uh, request um, through LinkedIn, and I also emailed you about it. Um, just give me a call and uh, let me know when I can get an interview. Um, uh, it's been about a week, so we'll we'll see what uh, what happens. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to get uh, an interview and uh, get that uh, get that job going. All right, call me when you can. Thanks. Hey, Muhammad, it's uh, Dennis again. Um, it's been about two weeks since I um, emailed you about that job. I called you a week ago. Uh, any possibility you can let me know if this job is still available? 
Um, I, I would appreciate it uh, so I can move on. Um, you know, maybe work at uh, somewhere else or something like that. But I'm really looking forward to this job because of the the SQL skills that I could obtain uh, before I get there, and possibly the, the C sharp or whatever that is. All right, um, give me a call when you get a chance. Thanks, bye. Hey, Mohammed, it's Dennis again. Um, uh, it's been about two months now and I haven't heard back from you. Um, just wondering, I'm getting a little impatient here. I, I don't know if I got to jump on something else or if I need to find AAA uh, hardware in, in the phone book and just call them myself. But, uh, I do have all the skills. Um, I, I went to, to computer school a long time ago, about 50 years ago. And I've had computer positions pretty much my whole life. So um, I'm hoping that this position is perfect for me. And uh, if you can get me in there, that would be uh, wonderful. Um, I guess if I don't hear from you, I'll, I'll call you again soon. All right. Thanks. Bye. Hey, Diane. How are you? Oh, Muhammad decided. Okay. Yeah, put him through. Um, what was it a couple months ago that, uh, that I talked to him? What, what was his last name anyway? Singh? Okay, Singh. Muhammad Singh. All right. All right, yeah, put him through. Muhammad, how are you? How's my candidate coming along? Yeah? No bites yet, huh? No, no one has, no one has all the skills that I put up there soft skills, speaking English, speaking to the warehouse people, SQL. I mean, everyone knows SQL. Did you spell it right on the, uh, on the LinkedIn website? SQL, not SQL. All right. Well, uh, you know, let me know if uh, anybody reaches out to you. Uh, um, I'm in need of somebody right away and uh, I would appreciate it if you, you know, got someone in here. All right. Thanks, Mohammed. All right, I'll I'll be waiting. Bye. Yeah, Muhammad Singh is who I'm looking for. Right, Muhammad. Hey, Muhammad, how are you? Good, good to hear from you. Um, it's been a while. I I reached out to you about two three months ago, and uh, is that position at AAA Hardware still available? Oh, it is. Okay. And they want me to take a test. Okay. An online test. All right. Well, why don't you go ahead and send me that email and, uh, and, uh, I'll go ahead and take it. It's on SQL, right? SQL. Okay. Yeah. I, I think I can wing it. How many questions? A hundred. And I got to take it within an hour and a half. All right. Multiple choice. All right. Yeah, I should be able to swing that. Okay, well that that sounds good. Uh, send me the link and uh, I'll uh, I'll get that uh, get that test done. Get you those results. Oh, it just came through actually. All right, let me uh, click on that link. All right, I'll call you when I'm done with it. Okay, welcome to uh, the C sharp testing arena. Why would I take a test on C sharp? I'm supposed to be taking the SQL. What the hell's going on? Muhammad. It's Dennis. It's a it's a C sharp test. Oh, the client wants C sharp? Why? I thought he wanted SQL. He was specific on he wanted C-sharp. Okay. All right. Well, I'll see what I can do with it, and uh, I'll try my best. And if I, if I pass it, then uh, let me know, and we can move forward. Okay? All right. Thanks. All right. C-sharp test. Here we go. Yeah, hi. This is the uh, hiring manager over at uh, AAA uh, Tool, Tool & Hammer. I'm looking for Muhammad Singh. 
Oh, he no longer works there? Okay. Who can take this particular position then for me? It's a triple A, triple A, triple A, yeah. All right. Well, I guess put me through to Sanjay Gupta. All right. Well, let me find out but, uh, what's going on with this position. I've been trying to call you guys for quite some time now, and I haven't gotten any feedback. All right. Well, let me talk to Sanjay. Hey, Sanjay. How are you? Uh, yeah, this is uh, the hiring manager from AAA. I'm looking uh, to get a candidate here for a couple of months now and uh, can't seem to get anybody. Uh, you're looking to look through your files to get back to me? All right. Sounds good, Sanjay. Um, well, I'll, I'll keep my uh, I'll keep my head up and uh, hopefully I'll get someone in here because these computers are getting older by the day. All right. Thanks. Hi, Mohammed Singh, please. Oh, he don't he no longer works there. Okay. Um, yeah, this is this is the applicant for triple A. Okay, sorry, put me through to Sanjay then. All right. Sanjay. Hi. Um, I'm the applicant for triple A. Yeah, they're looking for a candidate, a computer guy. With SQL. And they got and they made me take a C sharp test. Yes, yeah, that's right. All right. Oh, they want me to take a they want dot net now too. Okay, that doesn't make any sense. That didn't didn't come up in the first job description. Oh, the job job description changed. Okay. All right. Well, um, I'll take the dot net test and uh, see how I do and get the results. Back to you. All right. Thanks. All right. Dot net test we go. Okay, Sanjay. Well, it looks like I uh, got a B on the test for dot net and uh, I passed the C sharp. Are you looking for me to get an interview or uh, what's, what's the next steps? Okay. You're going to get me an interview. All right. Sounds good. All right. Send, send me the uh, go to meeting and uh, with the, uh, the hiring manager. All right. Thank you. Bye. Hi. Well, yeah, Dennis, it was great uh, interviewing with you. Um, it's good to know that you have all those skills, but uh, I was just looking for a computer guy. Yeah. Um, just someone to come out and take the look of these computers. Um, and then a little bit of SQL, I, I guess. SQL, everyone knows SQL. You know SQL, right? All right. Well, um, I'm uh, no. Well, I am in kind of Chicago. I'm I'm in Evanston. Yeah, but you can always take a cab from that from from the train station. That's not a big deal. Uh, yeah, it's a, a yeah. That's fine, and that, that that'll be good. Yeah. So why don't you come on in and. Um, yeah, take a look at these uh, computers and see what you can do with them. You see, yeah, you took you took some tests. Why why would you take tests? Yeah, C sharp. Yeah, C sharp's the that's that uh, little character above the three. And dot net. The heck is that? I don't I don't know why you took those tests, but anyway, the quicker I see you, the better. All right. Thanks. Bye. I'm going shopping. Well, thank you, hiring manager, for uh, reaching out to me and, and giving me that position. Uh, I'm excited. Um, I, I'll be in Evanston on Monday. All right. Well, thank you very much. And I uh, hope to see you again. Uh, well, I hope to see you on Monday. All right. Thank you. Hey, honey, oh. I got the job. Oh, she's going shopping.